Hey everybody, Colnar here, and welcome back to more NCAA Football 2005. In the last episode, we defeated Northwestern 82-0 for our first Big Ten win of the season, improving our record to 4-0. And let's take a look at the Sports Illustrated here. And as you can see, Colorado beat Missouri in a close one. So obviously, Colorado could be a potential threat to our season maybe who knows and basically the top five top six stayed the same Kansas State moved up uh, Virginia moved down Florida stayed the same West Virginia moved up Louisville moved down Wow uh, Michigan stayed the same uh, yep uh, Purdue moved up which is pretty crazy Iowa moved up Nebraska moved up, Auburn moved down, Colorado moves up. Cal, after losing to Oregon State, they fall from 15th to 21st. Wisconsin moved up to 23rd, of course. And looky here, Toledo in the Mid-American Conference is now in the top 25. And now the Heisman watch. Basically, San Antonio Holmes and Bam Childress stay the same. And then West Virginia's running back is now out of the top five. Louisville, Louisville's running back moves up. Memphis's running back moves up. And Auburn's running back moves down. Oof. And now for the players of the week. And look at that. National player, national offensive and defensive players of the week are San Antonio Holmes and AJ Hawk. Look at that. Ain't that a beauty? And then of course they would be the Big 10 offensive de and defensive players of the week. Why wouldn't they be? And then let's take a quick look at the conference standings here. So, Iowa right now is currently the leader in the Big Ten, and then you got Penn State in second, Purdue in third, and then we're in fourth. But don't worry, these standings will change very quickly. And look at Michigan, 1-1 one one in the Big Ten and below us. And look at that, Wisconsin's 4-1 and 1-1 one and one and one in the Big Ten as well. Interesting. And we had to play them today. So cool. But before we do that, I want to see the winner of this um, Texas-Oklahoma game. So we'll simulate that game. And Texas has upset Oklahoma, which means we're going to move up if we win. And let's see. And USC destroyed California, of course. Of course they would uh, destroy California. And Syracuse couldn't get it done. Man. But anyways, let's see what, what our... Toledo guy up. Toledo won by one point. And they're now 6-0. and Wow, they're 6-0 and and we're somehow 4-0. and Yeah, that doesn't make any sense for me. Does not make any sense. Alright, let's uncheck this game and hit play game. Okay. And it's a noon kickoff. Well, kind of noon kickoff. It's a 12.30 kickoff, but I call it noon... Because why not? It's noon kickoff to me. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. NCAA fractions again! Oh, uh, it's EJ Underwood this time. What did he do? He excused himself from practice again today without any explanation. He has not given a reason for his action at all. Well, you know what? That's a one-game suspension, yeah. You excuse yourself from practice without any explanation. You need a one-game suspension. So, yeah. One-game suspension for EJ Underwood for leaving practice. Hopefully it doesn't ruin our chances of winning against Wisconsin, though. So here we go. Number 23, Wisconsin against number 5, Ohio State. Let's do this. Ooh, and Wisconsin's got some injuries, but we don't have any injuries because why? Well, we're just that good. But then again, I did turn injuries off because why not? 
I don't like to see any of my players get injured. And wow, they got a suspended player too. They're running back. They've got two running backs out, so... Hmm, could the Mad Robber be useful? We'll have to wait and see. Oh yeah. And here comes Wisconsin. And there's Justin Zwick. He is now tied for first in touchdowns in the NCAA. Number one in touchdowns in the nation. Because he's stepping it up. And there's Justin Zwick getting, giving the team a pep talk before the game. Thank you guys. The team captains are on the and field. now here we go with the coin toss. Wisconsin will select heads. It is heads. They won the toss and they will receive. Which means we will get the ball in the second half. And we'll defend the north end zone. Ohio State lines up to kick this one off and we're just about set to get underway. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And a great kick by Mike Nugent for a touchback. All right, all right. That's what we were looking for. Now, Mad Robber helped us last time, but can it help us this time? Or will we have to switch it up? And tap that L2 button for the stadium pulse. Because it's a loud stadium, Ohio Stadium is. And tackled. For a loss. And that was Anthony Schlegel with that tackle for a loss. Good job, Anthony. One yard loss. All right. So, so far, so good. And look at that. Number one in yards allowed. 159 season average. First in the NCAA. Oh, Nate Saley almost picked that off. And nope, 57. We do not need your excessive celebration. Calm down. Man, Mike Kudala really wants to celebrate, but we can't have that. Now, come on, get that loud. Get loud, folks. Tipped and incomplete. And nope, we do not need some excessive celebration. Man, I, my team really wants to excessively celebrate after our big win against Northwestern. But then again, it was pretty good. But we don't need it. All right, pretty good punt by Northwestern, and cannot get away from that guy. So obviously, no yards on that play. All right, time to go shotgun with this. Let's see if Santonio Holmes can break free from these guys. The Buckeyes have five receivers on this play. They'll throw on first down. Oh, watch out for that guy! Throw it, and it's incomplete. I was getting pressured on that. Hey, you know what? Let's try wheelies. It's second down and ten to go. Ball on their own forty-two. Wisconsin put six DBs on the field to counter this five receiver look. He's looking. Gonna throw it to number twenty-nine, and he's got it. Twenty-nine caught it. What a catch by twenty-nine. I don't know who twenty-nine is, but he made a spectacular catch. That's exactly what you practice all the time, Brad. Ohio State has just been dominant on offense. We're going to go middle attack here. Bam Childress, he's open. And he's caught it. And Brutus loved that catch. So let's go fullback blast here on first and goal. 
on when they're backed up into the red zone. They'll get it off here. And down he All right. Goes. Some good yardage. That's why we hurry up to line. Gain three yards, hurry up to line, and run it again. All right, let's run it again, run it again, run it again. He's got this, he's got this. Touchdown, Ohio State, Brandon Joe, the fullback out of Westerville South High School. All right, let's go for the field goal here. I mean the extra point. Duh. Todd Beckman to hold it down. Mike Nugent to kick. And he's got it. It's good. All right, we score first against the number 23 team in the country. All right. Another top 25 matchup, and it's going pretty good so far. Our first top 25 matchup was against uh, NC State. I think after Wisconsin we play Iowa, so that's going to be another top 25 matchup. We're going to be playing a bunch of top 25 matchups, especially if we get to Purdue and Michigan ranked, because we play Purdue and Michigan at the end of the season, at the end of the regular season. So it's going to be very interesting if they can remain unbeaten for... We'll, we'll technically remain ranked for a couple more weeks. And broke up that pass, Nate Saley. And wow, Wisconsin's going to throw away that one. They saw that defensive pressure. All right, I'm tapping the L2 button to get maximum power. Oh, AJ Hawk almost got him. Pick it off. All right, we're good. Dustin Fox, stop your excessive celebration self because we do not need to get penalized for you excessively celebrating a good play. Calm down. Seriously. Okay, trying to let's go up the field now and eh, we tried. Now it's time for Mr. Zwick here, Justin Zwick, to just go down the field and just throw that ball crazy. And they'll look to capitalize on the good field position here. Here we go, Justin Zwick. Oh yeah, what a catch by Bam Childress. What do you think of that one, Mr. Corso? Well, I'm gonna say that was a nice catch. You got a bunch of yards there, and that's going to spread this. And look at those Buckeye fans. They said let's make some noise and they are. 25 for 30 in the red zone. That's pretty good. Bam, Childers. Oh, I got picked off. But keep them inside the five because we're going to try out a little thing called Mad Robber here. Okay, they're on the four. Let's see if Mad Robber can hold these guys in and possibly get a, get a safety. I hope they're going to run with the fullback, of course. Second and seven coming up here. Ball on the seven yard line. The Badger. Come out in the shotgun. They hand it off. And there's a flag. Let's see what the flag is. Holding on the offense. Uh, I'm going to decline it. And just nowhere to go for the running back. 
job here by the defense and that was a loss of a yard actually a gain of a yard oh well but they still had to punt to us so Wisconsin punt the ball to us and let us return for a touchdown hopefully oh spin move and we're inside the 35 all right Okay, we're going zigs out this time. Two minutes remaining in the first quarter. Okay, let's calm let's calm Buckeye Nation a little down. We like the we like the enthusiasm. We like that excitement, but we need a score, and we do! San Antonio Holmes, touchdown, Ohio State! And look at the fans, they are going crazy. They are happy. Look at this. This is a dime. Dime. That's a dime, folks. That was beautiful. And we just scored in four seconds. That's a new record. Kinda. Who knows. But yeah, they pick us off. We just uh, stop them. Make him go three and out, and we just throw a dime into the end zone. And it's a touchback. All right. You know what? Mad Robber actually is a working play here. So let's see if we can Mad Robber the Badgers again. They're going to run it, and they got a few yards on that. Four drive receivers, one running back. Oh, let's get the stadium pulse up. We need it up. Come on, we gotta get these guys out of whack. And AJ Hawk just met the quarterback. Hello. Let's look at that replay again. Oh yeah, that 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 was a beautiful tackle, a beautiful sack by Mr. AJ Hawk. And now we gotta get this stadium pumping. Maximum crowd noise. Maximum noise. AJ Ockham. Oh, wow, guys. Really? We could have had them go three and out, and instead we give them a first down. I guess we got to increase that stadium pulse. And tips by Ashton Ubody. And nope, Ashton, we do not need to get penalized. So it's second and ten. This is the fifth play of this drive. Wisconsin comes out with two tight ends. Okay, guys, we could have got him back down behind the line of scrimmage, but we gave him a few yards. What is up with that? We did not want to do that. Okay, two yards. Okay. My bad. I was a little concerned, but we're good now. Increase the stadium pulse. Oh, it, nope. That's an incomplete pass. That's an incomplete pass. Yep. Incomplete. They have to go punt it to us. <laughs> Wisconsin thought they had a first down, but nope. They have to punt. Because they caught it out of bounds, and you can't catch it out of bounds because it's an incomplete pass. All right, cover me, guys. Oh, I got a bunch of badgers on me. I got near to the 50 yard line. I mean, that's pretty good. Oh, really? We stepped out at the 49. Boo, we were at the 50. Boo. This game is so mean. All right. 
Well, we'll we'll take it from the 49. He goes downtown. Oh! Did it like tip his hand? <laughs> I think it did tip his hand in just in. Oh man, what is up with that? That's fine. We'll just run the same play again. This time he's gonna catch it. Told you! Oh, breaks a tackle! Touchdown, Ohio State! And look at Bucky Badger. He is angry because he is angry. He's always angry. You know a mascot who we didn't see in the previous episode was uh, the Wildcat for Northwestern. I guess the Wildcat decided to uh, take the day off because he knew Ohio State would run over Northwestern. <laughs> so now it's time to attempt the extra point. Todd Beckman to hold Mike Nugent to kick. And it's good. Yes! 11 seconds that time for that drive. And only two plays. My goodness. 21-0 at the end of the first. This is what I like to see against, you know, top rank, like, ranked opponents. You know, if we dominate today, if we dominate against Wisconsin, I think we should be moving up to number two instead of Texas. Because, come on, we have the team to win a national championship. Come to think of it, Ohio State always has teams to win national championships. Yeah, Audible's not working out for you, buddy. See, I told you, the audible did not work out. And Mike D'Andrea with the tackle for a loss. Yeah, it looks like we're not going to get in there playing, are we? Unless they go quick. Yep, they go quick. And Quinn Pitcock with the tackle for a loss. And Ohio State fans doing the wave. And that's the end of the first. Ohio State leads 21-0 against Wisconsin. Man, this is pretty good. It's pretty good. All right, tap that L2 button to increase the stadium pulse and make sure they don't get an audible off. Oh, yep. That audible is not going to be working out for you. Told you the audible didn't work. We told you. We told you, and the fans are loving it, that we have tried to tell you the audible is not going to work. And now it's 4th and 11. Uh -oh. Whoa, whoa. Okay, that just happened. But don't worry, we'll be fine. No, I don't want weak. I want the shotgun. Shotgun. They'll set up shot at the 48 yard line. They'll work from the shotgun. All right, let's see who should I throw to. Uh, oh, San Antonio Holmes looks They'll like a pretty good option. Down. Ah, shoot. All right, well, you sack us. We're going to go quick. All right, hurry up. Hurry up, everyone. Get to the line. Get to the line so we can tire out Wisconsin. Offensive line, please protect me this time. Oh. That's an open. Oh! I thought I put a lot of power into that throw. Well, you know what? We'll just we'll just run the same play and make them tired. Make Wisconsin tired as heck. Oh, catch it. Oh, is that... There are two footballs on the field. Wow. Well, Wisconsin stopped us, and there's nothing we can do here, so might as well punt it. So good job, Wisconsin. You managed just to make us go three and out. They come out in a punt formation. Josh Houston to punt. It's a way and it's a booming punt. It's a booming punt. Please tackle him. Number eight. Cool. Alright. That was a good kick coverage. Here. 
Being sacked by AJ Hawk. What a sack. Let's take a look at another that replay. Boom! What a hit. Just what a hit. Loss of six yards, second and sixteen. Get him. Pick it. Dang it. Third and inches. All right, we got him third and inches. Third and inches. We're good. We just got to stop him here. It looks like they're probably going to run. If we could just stop him on third and inches, that'd be amazing. And we do. AJ Hawk just stopped him on third and inches. Unbelievable. This man, AJ Hawk. Give him a Heisman Trophy as well. Seriously. We need to give him the Heisman Trophy as well. Or make him, you know, the best defensive player of the year award. And we'll just run straight in. Nothing I can really do there. Alright. 40 yards to get a touchdown. Well, that should be easy. Because we're going to go zigs out. And we're going to throw to San Antonio Holmes. Because why not? Oh, that's up. That's beautiful. That is a catch inside the 10. The fans are loving it. I love it. Let's go fullback dive this time. Change it up a little bit. And Brandon Joe. Okay. Let's try it again. Hurry up to line. Hurry up to line. Everybody hurry up to line. Everyone get set. Go. Oh, keep going. Keep going. Alright, good. 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 All right, three yards on that. We can get another three yards. It's a touchdown. All right. Uh, so do I go for it or do I just take the free points? Oh, boy. You know what? Free points. Just kidding. I was just kidding. I'm going for it. Even though you might call me insane on this, but I like to think of it as a surprising choice of stuff. Fake it, throw it to 87. I got picked off. Well, okay, note to self. Do not go for two. I mean, do not go for it on fourth down because you might get picked off. Well, that's fine. I'll just have Mad Robber, our defense, go crazy with Mad Robber. They run. Didn't get that far. And Northwestern's calling timeout. Um, okay. Don't know why. But probably because it's under two minutes. Um, strange, but... Okay. Hello! You just met Bobby Carpenter, and he destroyed you. That was beautiful. Alright, increase that stadium pulse. Bring the noise, folks! Bring the noise! I don't think they can call hike here. They're not able to call hike. They might get penalized. They might get penalized. Nope, nope. They got it off. And it's a run play. You ran for it on third down. And long. You ran. They gave up. They're, they gave up. They're, they're probably waiting for, you know, halftime. And then, then all of a sudden they'll get everything smoothly grooving or whatever. Okay. Stay impulse is not coming up. They're just trying to run down our clock, man. It's not cool. Number 31 gets it off. Number four. Oh yeah. Oh 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 oh. 
I was ha I was hoping San Antonio Holmes would take that back for a touchdown. Oh well. All right, San Antonio, please catch this. Dang it, I overthrew it. Okay, well, they're probably going to expect me to throw it to San Antonio Holmes again, which means I'm going to go throw it to Roy Hall this time. And hopefully he catches it. Oh, he's open. He was green. And dropped it. Crap. All right, uh, let's go back to middle attack and hopefully... Bam, Childress can catch it this time. Ohio State comes out with five receiver. Oh, he's got this. He got it. Touchdown. They didn't expect me to throw it to Bam Childress this time. Alright, I will give Wisconsin credit. They have held us to one touchdown this quarter. Even though they they uh, let us score three touchdowns against them in the first quarter. Still, I, I think it's pretty good. Pretty good so far. And now Mike Nugent to kick it off to Wisconsin for the last 40 seconds of this first half. Alright, here we go. First and ten for Wisconsin here. Oh boy. And they call timeout. Give my secondary a boost here. Alright, let's increase the stadium pulse. And AJ Hawk just sacked the quarterback. And look at that Ohio State fan. He is happy about it. Don't know what dance moves he got, but either way, he's happy. Second and 15. Let's increase the stadium pulse even more. Looks like we can't get it up. Well, they just ended the quarter. Okay. Whatever. And we'll resume the game. And they will kick off to us. Ready to kick it away. Number four and number twenty-six back to return. Kicks it off. And Ashton Ubody will return this kickoff. And Ashton Ubody. Ashton Ubody. He almost went. He almost went all the way. Oh well. All right. Let's go shotgun again. Let's try middle attack again with Bam Childress. All right, that got batted down. Okay. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 37. The Buckeye have five receivers on this play. Look. This time I'm going to throw to Roy Hall. Tipped and incomplete. Thank God it didn't get caught. Yeah, really good heads up play there to get a hand on the football by the defense. Third and ten. Ball on their own 37. Ohio State lines up in a shotgun set. Back to pass. Looking. He rolls. Throwing it to San Antonio Holmes and wow, he didn't even look back at it. Guess we gotta go punt it away. And Josh Houston will punt this ball away. It's fourth down and the punt team lines up. Punts the ball away. 
And Ashton Ubodi with the tackle. No gain, that's pretty good. Second and ten. And tackle for a loss, all right. That was 94. Marcus Green, yes. Second and, I mean, third and 12. Why did I think it was second and 12? Oh. Incomplete. All right, time for Wisconsin to punt the ball away. Yeah, couldn't get up the field. And they'll look to capitalize on the good field position here. Wisconsin has all their DBs in for this five wide set. He lets it go deep down the middle. Oh yeah. That was beautiful. Fullback blast this time. So they're back in the red zone where they threw a pick on their last visit. And off to the fullback. And they make the stop. The fullback gains about four. All right, hurry up to line. And they'll go with a no huddle. They're crowding the line. They'll go with a run. Touchdown. The fullback explodes. Okay. We don't need to celebrate, Brandon. I know you're happy about that, but do not need to lose 15 yards on that. All right, 35 to nothing. All right. It's pretty good. Kicks it off. No chance for a return. It'll come out to the 20. Not a very good series for this offense on their last drive as they were forced into a three and out. Boy, oh boy, they had nothing going last time. Yeah, maybe Scooter, you need to get out there and show them what you're made of. Somebody get me a helmet quickly. Defense lines up with eight men in the box. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. And they hit him in the Hey, back. user tackle for a loss. I'll take it. Alright. Second and thirteen for Wisconsin now. Second and thirteen. Ball on the seventeen yard line. The sellout crowd is really making a difference now as these guys can't even call the play. Pick it. Wow. Oh boy. Come on, guys. We can't let Mad Robert fail us. I mean, who was guarding that guy? Okay, we're going to take a break from Mad Robert and do all out blitz. And that one worked. Cool. Okay, nope, no, we do not need to start a fight. Receivers. 
And nowhere to go. Quinn Pitcock with the tackle for a loss. Okay, we do not need to start a fight. Why are we starting fights now? First it was starting excessive celebrations. And now it's starting fights. We don't want to start a fight. Jeez. That's how we get penalized for unsportsmanlike conduct. And lose 15 yards. And we give them the first down. It would make me very sad. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, there goes San Antonio Holmes. Uh, he fumbled, but it's out of bounds. All right. We're all good now. We are all good now. Oh, San Antonio Holmes, he is open. He didn't catch it. What? Huh? What? What? I am just, I am just confused. And this time he's catching it. Instead, he'll just tip it up high and incomplete. Oh boy, dude. San Antonio, you're not helping your case for Heisman, man. I, I, I want you to win the Heisman, but the Heisman voters are going to be like, uh, why is this guy not catching footballs? He's supposed to be the top receiver in the country. Why is he not catching the football? Don't worry. Bam is here to help us out. We're all good. We're all good now. And it's time to catch Northwestern, I mean not Northwestern, Wisconsin off guard. And throw it to Bam Childress again. And incomplete, okay. Okay, back to the drawing board. Uh, you know, Roy Hall hasn't got any playing time. Well, he has got playing time, but he hasn't caught anything yet. So let's give him a chance to catch this football. Incomplete. Of course. Of course, of course, of course, of course, of course, of course, of course. It makes me very sad. Come on, we cannot go under 500 for third down conversions. And we just did. Alright. Mike, please help us out and give us a field goal. Cool. And that was not an easy kick, guys. Forget about it. This kid can make it from 60 yards or further. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Kicks it off. Number 81. I'm just going to need it. Okay. Well, I can safely say we're not going to score 80 points against uh, Wisconsin. But, um... They come out with four hey, we tried. Okay, Bobby. We don't need you to celebrate. My goodness. Why is Bobby trying to celebrate every time, you know, there's a good play? We make a lot of good plays. Yes, that's true, but... We don't need to excessively celebrate and lose 15 yards. Oh, please pick it. Oh, wow. Okay. Well, congratulations, Wisconsin. You just scored against us. But you're still down by 31, so I wouldn't get that excited. All you gotta do is just stop me at, at like, midfield possibly, and then you just force us to punt. That's all you gotta do, but if we get over midfield, then we're just gonna kick field goals and you'll just lose. Seriously. All you gotta stop, you just gotta stop us at the 50-yard line or lower, and then 
you basically got us beat. But if you, but if we get over that 50-yard line and kick a bunch of field goals, we basically win. So basically, this is a test to see if you can actually hang with us. Going back to the shotgun formation. This time to Roy Hall and it's incomplete. How about that? He's got to come up with that catch here. Yeah, you're right, coach. This is a catch that has to be made. All right, hurry up to the line. Let's try and get these Badgers tired out. Ohio State lines up in a shotgun set. Back to pass. Looks. Fire. San Antonio Holmes incomplete. The corner made a good play on the ball. He sure did. This kid is very athletic. You know, I'm really going to be happy when I get Troy Smith back from his suspension. It's third down and ten. Unless the game just decides, hey, he's suspended again, which I'm going to be mad. Incomplete again. Well, Wisconsin's going to have us pun again. Alright, Ashton Yabodi making the tackle. That was a 50 yard plus punt? Cool. Yeah, we'll take the necessary, you know, campus challenge points. Why not? Alright, first and ten here for the Badgers. I'm just gonna QB sneak it, really. That wasn't really a good play because you just got back to your original line of scrimmage. The Badger go with the eye formation, makes a move. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. Good penetration by the defense there as they tackle him for a loss. Nope, we don't uh, we don't need to start a fight. And that's the end of the third quarter. So, Wisconsin, they got points. But we still lead 38-7, to so it's a 31-point game. Don't know if they can actually score 31 points in five minutes, but... Eh. Okay, come on. Alright, so obviously it's not working. Let's go dog zone blitz this time. My God, so many fights breaking out. Jeez. Second and eleven, and this is the fifth play of the current drive. They'll use a four-four defense here. Back to pass. He'll dump this one off. Guys, someone must have got the hand up there because that ball came out of there kind of funny. You bet. Quarterback let it fly, but it had no chance after that big tree got in the way. So another third down upcoming for the offense. Alright, let's see what happens on this third and eleven. Drops back to pass. He steps up. He tosses it short. Incomplete. Alright. And now it's time to return this punt. And the punt team will come out. It's fourth down. Number thirty one gets it off. Number four takes it to 25. He retreats. Oh, come on. Couldn't do anything on that one. Don't know why, but I just couldn't. Boy, oh boy, they had nothing going last time. Yeah, maybe, Scooter, you need to get out there and show them what you're made out of. Somebody get me a helmet quickly. They'll set up shot at the 26. Wisconsin has all their DBs in for this five wide set. Going deep. Oh, tipped out of his hands again. 
tipped out of his hands again. Why is his hand so bouncy? Like it's in his hands and then it bounces out of his hands. Like how is that even possible? It shouldn't be possible. Oh, Roy Hall, please catch it. He caught it and he's inbounds. That's a first down. That's a first down. Um, I'm, I'm taking that. I am taking that to the bank. Oh. He made the catch, but it was outside the white line. If he would have stayed in bounds, it would have been a touchdown. But that's fine. Oh, jeez. Man, the Ohio State fans are angry. Oh, that's a catch. Yep. And, he's and Brutus is happy. Boy, Brad, you said it. That is a big time play there. A spectacular catch and great body control there on the long pass reception. Fullback dive. Looks confident as they held him to a field goal on their last red zone trip. He plows ahead for a two yard gain. They put everyone up on the line. Here's the give. Brought down. That'll be All right, hurry up to line again. Touchdown. Okay, we don't need to celebrate, Brandon. I know we're happy that we had a touchdown, but still, we don't need to be celebrating. Just don't need to be celebrating at all. Leading by 38 points again. Good. Now this next two minutes and 47 seconds is going to be interesting. What is North? Uh, not Northwestern. Wisconsin. Wisconsin. What is Wisconsin going to do? That is the biggest question I have had right now. Comes to the line with three wide. And AJ Hawk sacks the quarterback because the quarterback does not know where he was going. Okay, seriously, we do not need to cause another fight. So many fights in this game. Like, sheesh. Time to return this. Alright, okay. Um, we did something, but okay. Alright, uh, let's see. Since we got the ball back with a minute 55 left. You know what I'm going to do. I'm going to score again. And it's going to be awesome. Just, just watch. Just watch this play. 
San Antonio's got this. He got it. Of course. Now we're just going to run the ball in with Brandon Joe and uh, call it a day. Oh, what a touchdown. Dude, don't be excessively celebrating. We're going to be ending up kicking a 50 long yard field goal. And I'm. It's probably going to be 50 yards. 50 yard field goal. Well, 50 yard extra point all the way back there, but thankfully I was able to stop your excessive celebration. And yeah. 52 to 7. Mm -mm -mm. Number 4 and number 81 deep to return. Kicks it deep. And they can forget about returning this one. So the offense takes over and the last time they had the ball, they had a tough time getting anything going. It's first and 10, ball on their own 20. They'll use a 4-4 defense here. And tackled by Anthony Schlegel. They sent the blitz and drilled the running back before he could find any daylight. Yeah, Wisconsin's basically giving up right now. So all we gotta do is just run Mad Robber a bunch of times and they just give up. Defense lines up with eight minutes of the And he is drilled. And the linebacker comes up and makes a big stop. This is textbook. This is how you're supposed to play against the run. Yeah, and that time the defense got him to go backwards. All right, and of course they got a punt to us. Mm -mm -mm. Wisconsin thought they had a chance against us, but nope, they didn't. Spin moving. All right. All right. Let's go. Zigs out again. And San Antonio Holmes is going to catch this football. If not, I'm going to be sad. Oh, he is wide open. Wide open. Almost broke free. Okay, we're gonna go go line formation, fullback dive. Another trip to the red zone. Last time. Oh, what a touchdown! Touchdown, Ohio State. You know what? Let's try to get 60 points. Let's go for it. And Buckeye fans are not liking the decision for me to go for it on. We'll go for two here. Eh. They liked it anyway. 60 to 7. A 53 point lead over Wisconsin. Truly amazing. Okay, no, we do not need to start another fight. What is up with my players wanting to start fights? And this offense is having a difficult time doing anything at the line of scrimmage. And he's tackled. They get a yard on the play. 
Yeah, that's probably game. That's the game. Unless they want to try and run another play. But I wouldn't advise it. And they're going to run one more play. They throw it. It's caught. But nothing else. And that's it. We win. I win. That's a W. A W. Let's go. We have taken down number 23, Wisconsin. And Wisconsin's going to be unranked next week after that 53 point win. And I dropped 60 on them. So, and they only dropped 7 on me, so. Not bad, not bad. Only giving up one touchdown. That's. That's basically where we need to be. But I really don't really want to have to give up a touchdown or whatever and Florida won by one point shocking whoops don't want to look at the drive summary so yeah the box score is pretty good I mean yeah it's whatever oh my goodness Minnesota upset Michigan that is hilarious I love it and Oklahoma State upset Colorado. Wow. Some pretty big upsets here. And NC State... Did I just say NC State lost North Carolina? Eh. Alright, we're now 5-0 and overall. 2-0 and in the Big Ten. Yes! And new accomplishments to my EA Sports bio. I'd love to save that. Okay. Don't want to save my files yet. Now yeah, let's simulate this game. Okay, West Virginia won. Nebraska won. Uh, let's check out Purdue here. Oh my god, Penn State upset Purdue. Dang. They just got destroyed. Missouri beat Baylor. Tennessee beat Georgia. All right. Well, we won't be seeing Georgia in the national championship. Wow, Auburn. You really lost to Louisiana Tech? Really? Auburn lost to Louisiana Tech. I am very dumbfounded about that. I am dumbfounded because it's very... Like, what? What? How do you do that? It makes no sense. My mind is now... Mm, my mind is now extremely confused. Really? Michigan didn't get unranked? After they lost to Minnesota? Boo! And lucky here, we have to go up against Iowa. We didn't move... Wait. Hold on. We didn't move up in the polls? Excuse me? Tennessee moved up. Uh, excuse me. Excuse me. No. No. We are not getting screwed over by Tennessee again. That is in That is insulting. That's an insult. What an insult. This game is insulting us. Well, if we take down Iowa, then maybe, just maybe, we have a chance. Uh, let's see who else is in the Memphis joins the top 25 and Penn State joins the top 25. Oh, well cool for them And Wisconsin's now unranked So let's see how many big ten teams are there? There's one two three four and Then five so five big ten teams in the top 25 of this coach's poll and Louisville, eh. 
But they want to be, you know, national title contenders. Oh, look at that. The AP poll is actually nice to us. They're actually friendly to us. They actually think we should be number four. Unlike Tennessee. And we got some first place votes. Well, technically just one. And Wisconsin still ranked in the AP poll? Hmm. It's weird. Now let's take a look at the Heisman watch. Justin Zwick is now in the Heisman? What? How is Justin Zwick now in the top five for our Heisman trophy? He's only played two games because Troy Smith got suspended. Okay, well, that's interesting, but Troy Smith is still going to be the starting quarterback. He's still going to be the starting quarterback. And Marshall's wide receiver is the Offensive National Player of the Week. And Colorado's defensive linebacker is the National Defensive Player of the Week. And no Buckeyes are on the Player of the Week for the Big Ten, Offensive and Defensive. Only a, the cornerback from Penn State and the halfback from Illinois. Interesting. And Penn State has the 3-0... Well, 3 0 record for the lead in the Big Ten. Alright, so all I gotta do is beat them and I win the Big Ten Championship, technically. But actually, let's check my team schedule real quick. So I got Iowa, Indiana, Penn State, Michigan State, Purdue, and then Michigan. Okay, so. After Iowa, it's gonna be halfway through the season. Then we just got Indiana, Penn State, Michigan State, Purdue, Michigan. And Indiana's 0-6, so that should be an easy game. But Iowa, yeah, it's probably going to be a tough one. Because they're four, number 14 in the country. Yeah, the number one, uh, they're, they're good in rush offense. Wow, Ohio State, we are literally last in rush offense. But we're number one in points per game. We're number one in pass offense, number one in total defense, number one in rush offense, 61st in pass defense, and ninth in turnover difference. Yeah, so it could be a tough game in Iowa City, Iowa, but uh, we'll have to wait until the next episode. The next episode, to, because we'll play him in the next episode, because, you know, it's the end of this episode, so... With that, guys, I'd like to thank you all for watching this brand new episode of NCAA Football 2005. If you enjoyed it, smack a like on it, subscribe if you're new to this channel, check out my other videos I've uploaded to my channel, and I shall see you guys next time for when we go to Iowa City, Iowa to take, to take on the Iowa Hawkeyes in a big top 25 matchup. So until then, guys, I'll see you guys later.